Last year, zero fatalities in Nevada recorded 257 deaths on Clark County roads. It's a number Metro Police want to bring down, and they're starting by looking at the valley's most dangerous intersections. Fox 5's Mike Allen is at one of them now at Eastern and Russell. He spoke to people in the area on a story you saw first on Fox 5. Yeah, John, since coming to this intersection earlier tonight, Eastern and Russell, and spending a little bit of time here, lots of honking, lots of speeding, luckily no crashes that I've seen, but talking with the folks who spend a lot of time at this intersection, that is not an uncommon occurrence. It blocks off all the intersections. By the time two ambulances pull up and, and tow truck comes, it, it affects everybody. I mean, my business, the, all the next door neighbors, it, everybody gets affected. Dion Yagubi runs a pizza shop on Russell and Eastern, an intersection recently identified as being one of the deadliest in the valley. It stops people from coming to my shop, you know, and I have to pay my rent. I talked with one of his customers who says he agrees. He drives by often to drop his sister off after work. When I usually drop her off, I'd be seeing a car crash. Right here. I here, I don't ever really see what causes the accident, but I always see there's an accident right here. Both Ace Harris and Yagubi have similar ideas about how to make this area safer. The lighting, there's barely any lights. It'd be too dark. I feel like that, that could play a part in the reason why there's crashes. It'd be dark on the street. LVMPD will have more patrols in the area, along with the other intersections you see on this map, looking to do more than just discipline people. We need to change our mentality about fatalities in general. Um, we historically have more people killed on the roadways than we have homicides. It's almost like it's become acceptable and we cannot allow fatals to become acceptable. We need to change that mindset. That mindset, Yagubi says, it's a distracted one. Most accidents are at night. There are Uber drivers checking their phones. These people are doing a million things, you know, they just, they just don't pay attention. Just this month, since the start of the new year, Metro Police have reported 12 deadly crashes in the valley in their jurisdiction. That is one about every two days. Reporting live tonight, Mike Allen, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas. This new initiative means more enforcement and tra traffic laws at those intersections, which Lieutenant Brett Fricklin tells Fox 5 will likely result in more citations.